Hello viewers, this is Dr. Rana and today I am going to start a new lecture series uh, which is actually on the latex software and uh, if you are a beginner then this series will really help you a lot. I will give you a quick uh, or even a shortcuts to write uh, beautiful uh, articles and uh, even a thesis also. Uh, you know very well that latex is a document preparation software for high quality typesetting. It is the most common use for medium to large technical or scientific documents but it can be used for almost any form of publishing so first and foremost uh, I should start uh, with the best uh, text editor uh, you need to know first so in the first video I am going to compare uh, different uh, text editors uh, before I go for that comparison of text editor you should know the, uh, the important thing which you should install first so first important thing is the distribution of the tech or letting tracking system you first install uh, the mic tech or tech clip the link is available here if you go to this mic tech org the this is the mic tech you can download the basic installer if you are working 64 bit otherwise you can download the basic installer for 32 bit also if you are uh, working in the mac you can go to this site in this site if you you can see that this is available this download for the mac tech so but uh, here I am focused only for the window based uh, software so I'll go for the MicTech so in the window based software this is the distribution you need all the packages or the basic installer and uh, as uh, this will uh, this is called uh, this contains the several packages for handling uh, the typesetting the difference between tech and latex tech is all about the formatting of the document it means that whatever you are writing in the source you will get a pdf or dvi file in the output this is uh, actually based on the tech it is actually a computation or special algorithm based on the optimal flow of text in your document whereas the page is font set spacing is handled by the tech but what is the latex latex is a set of micro micros built on the tech like if you are writing a paper you need uh, to write uh, some formatting like if your section tables this all commands are is under the latex so uh, so you need a latex to write a source so in order to change the source you it, it it gives you the formatting of your content in source so handling or writing is handled by the latex the output is handled by the tech so you can say that uh, both uh, have some difference so tech and latex so if you are uh, talking about the tech editor so important thing that which tech editor you uh, wish to start with if you are the beginner so you should know the what is the uh, the best and what uh, your tech editor should have so for this i'll go for the wikipedia page wikipedia page is uh, for the comparisons of text editor when you go to this page you can see that there is a several tech editors are available when edit archimedes tech editing scientific workplace there is about 50 tech editors are available and based on this they have uh, having the properties like properties of tech editor one so i will given that this some special properties should tech editor should have and next it should have some another properties also and if third there is a three level uh, properties are given by this wikipedia and i should uh, give you that which one is the best for you to start with if you uh, see the first property the editing style obviously there are two type of editing style first is your source based in which you can write the code and your output it output is in some somewhere else like in your pdf form you can get the output but another one is this what you see is what you mean this is just like your uh, microsoft document or you can say the open office document whatever you write you will see it on the screen so these days many people think that uh, this source based uh, is not very beneficial it's not easy to learn but these all are uh, you can say that uh, what you see is what you mean based softwares are easy to use this is right if you're uh, going to use this software it will give you a direct in uh, the faces that GUI it's uh, playing a role and you will get a tech file but if you wish to import and export the tech file from this to some other source you may find some difficulties so i suggest you first to start with source based software and don't worry i'll go will start with the source based software and after that uh, once i complete with source based software tutorials and then i go for one software 
which is actually based on just like same as your wall document or you can say that your open office document so this is important so i'll fix the editing style source based next is the your native operating system so most of you work with window some of you work with mac and linux so you must uh, clear that uh, you start with those software which actually work in every platform so so with you can see that some of them work in in every platform but some is only on linux some in only in beam in based browser based b is called the browser based so the next is the stable version this is not a issue cost is important if you are paying something if you pay for the software obviously uh, it uh, so i am not focusing on the payment i will go for the free uh, free wares so we wish to so you can see the most of softwares are free here so out of this editing style is the important but uh, native operating system cost and last one is integrated viewer it means that whatever you have written it will give you the output on the same platform you need not to go to some uh, folder and you will get the and most important is your pdf output so you can see that when you click on this you can see that these are all the software which doesn't provide integrated viewer I mean pdf viewer so you must see that there are most of software are available they'll give you a pdf even dvi viewers so you must focus on the pdf anyways out of this in the first property which is called a text editor property number one you can see that i just collect a data and finally i'll come in that based on this tech studio tech work tech pen optech ellipse tech city easy tech maker kyle these all software has uh, properties which contains uh, each and everything you can just see that most of uh, tech softwares when you click on this alphabetically is available here and you can see the tech or tech studio tech works all are good but tech studio you can see that is good for everything and this is good for thing when the tech pad is non free and so out of this i have selected i have select these software you can start with any of them but now i'll go for the next next property when i go to the next property you can see that property number 2 inverse search is important this is means that once you have written a constructed a dbi file when i click on the error if you find some error in your output if you have some mistake in your output just click on this it will give you the inverse search on the screen means on the source file so this is important projects organized project is important menu for inserting symbol is is extremely important uh, preferences so you can see that these are the software it doesn't have such privilege on this so other software have this and uh, last one is multiple undo redo options and spell checking also so dictionaries are uh, should should be there and you can see that there are several dictionaries available even uh, i'll cut short some text editor and finally i'll stick with this uh, five editors and third one is we are left with third properties so out of these all properties this one is important the intelligence error handling some softwares do not give you the uh, good uh, error once you run the codes you find some error and uh, maybe the error is something else and you are searching somewhere else so this is important thing and unicode support is important and everything written here is important in some other context so you may see that all three types of properties are important so you can see that this five software has all the properties here as a yes in octac you can see that everything is yes is here so all software are good but octac required the emac clips required a you can see that it required a plugin so i should not prefer both of them so you are left with only three so out of three when you see that tech maker are mostly people are working but some of them are saying that when you are dealing with a big code it will took a time and comparatively so as compared to tech studio tech studio framework uh, is is comparatively better as compared to tech maker so i can say that i should delete this the next one is cal cal is is for those which are actually working on the linux but now it's available for even window and uh, even for the mac comparatively better you can say that from out of tech studio and cal i'll go for tech studio
so you can go for the guy also it's not an issue but you can start with uh, any text editor it's up to you if you are uh, you can able to pay this so many of people are uh, when you click on this many people are working with this win edit so it's window based only you can start with win edit but most problem is this integrator and back to this in the comparison you can see that when you click on this there is what you see is what you mean editing style based software is available uh, so you can see that out of this i'll work on likes so likes is is uh, can be operating on any uh, any operating system from the after completing with the latex i'll go for the likes and uh, this likes view but once you sh you should have some uh, knowledge of latex uh, commands also otherwise you may be stuck somewhere else if you're using the likes directly so this is uh, all about for today's lecture and if you like this video you can subscribe to my channel scientific rana and uh, hope hope you like this video and have a nice day